Sit. We did off the alum curve and showed that the change in the output level causes a movement along the alum curve. We are now going to look at shifts of the alum curve. Changes in the nominal money supply shifts the alum curve. It is important that you know the effect of a change in money supply on the alum curve. You must be able to show whether a change in the money supply shifts the alum curve to the left or to the right. What we need to take with us from this section is the difference between a movement along the alum curve caused by a change in the output level and a shift of the alum curve caused by a change in the money supply. Lulu! <laughs> <laughs> Woo!